Gala moved top of the RBS Premiership on Saturday with a convincing win over border rivals Hoyk. With a little uncertainty from the crowd, the host scored first, with centre Ewan Scott landing a penalty. Then with a clean ball from the scrum, captain Granny Graham found winger Grant Somerville who touched down for the first try of the match. Soon after, Samoan Apeta Palapoy rose high in the line-out and broke away from the defence, touching down and extending Gala's lead. It was then Hoig's turn for some points. Neil Rennick saw the gap and made 30 yards. But with Gala pinged at the breakdown, he was left to kick at goal. Gala were on the score sheet once again after some quick thinking from Graham. A quick tap penalty and hands out wide to find fullback Graham Spears, who was left to dive in over the line. Hoyk finally found the whitewash in the start of the second half. A break from number eight Keith Davis, and then a series of missed passes, which found Neil Rennick, who was waiting on the wings. Rennick converted his own score. Hoyk's efforts were in vain though. No more than five minutes later and Gala had scored again. This time it was back row Tom Weir with a try. Gala finished the match with a flurry. The forwards first turned the ball over then Edinburgh rugby EDP Chris Alls showed his skill with a clever backhanded pop. This sent Somerville in for his second score of the match, which came with a giant roar from the Netherdale crowd. The final score, 32-13. It was a lot better from last week. I mean, we, uh, we had to improve from last week a lot, and then we uh, we just done the basics right this week. And uh, it, it needed to happen. We always knew there was going to be a dogfight with uh, with Hoyk, and we just wanted to come out, come out on top of it. We got the five bon uh, the try bonus point, which is even better. Um, as you say, they got the try bonus point. Grant Somerville had quite a game. It was a good use of the backs. How did it feel out, out on the pitch? There? It felt good. I mean, we, when we were getting clean ball, it felt like we, we could run from anywhere, and we uh, we, were, we were doing a lot of line breaks. It's just we need to keep that momentum going, and we need to keep that intensity up on the field. Was there a bit of an extra boost given it was a, a border derby against Hoyk? Well, you, you always lift a game for a border derby. I mean, every game's massive in this league, but when, when you're playing the likes of Hoyk and Melrose, you've got to up your game at a little 5 10% just to make sure. Is it more of the same for next week? Hopefully. I mean, uh, we're back on track now. We had a bit of a blip last week, and we just need to keep going from here.